Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Kerbal Space Program. And I'm actually about to land on the moon here. Um, I am pretty close here to actually land on the surface. And it looks like it's going pretty well. And, you know, I wanted to actually record me while doing a successful landing. So, that's, uh, so that's what we're going to do here. I didn't want to add, you know, do it by myself. So, here we go. Um, let's just keep... Uh, coming down nice and slow, slower, slower. Okay. Oh no, nope, I'm turning it the wrong way. Ah, you got to be kidding. Wait, wait. Oh, <laughs> it, it breaks off. Really? <sighs> wow. I was so sure I had that one in the bag. All right, quick load. Um, now, did I save this time before? I did. Okay, good. I saved right before that. Okay, so here we go. Let's uh, bring the gear down. You know, in other words, extend the struts. Maybe. A little listen. There it goes. Okay. So, let's go and line ourselves up once again. And I'm going to actually do it this time. Alright, let's speed ourselves up and actually get up to the moon. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, that should be good. Slow down. Okay. So now let's go get ourselves up here and line up nice. Be there. Good. Okay. So <clears throat> let's slow ourselves way down. We're going really fast. So let's go and slow down here. Bring myself to 200. And okay, that's good. So let's speed back up, get ourselves a little bit closer here. Nope, can't speed up anymore now since we're so close to the ground. Alright, makes sense. <coughs> Excuse me, alright. Ah, oh, crap. Are we going to really land on that? Hold on. Let's avoid, avoid that spot. Let's see if we can land here instead. We really don't want to uh, land there if we can help it. Okay. Let's straighten ourselves out a bit. I hope we're not on as steep of a angle this time. Okay, so let's slow ourselves down nicely here. All right. All right. Good, good. Let's keep these on just a tad bit so that way. I do have some thrust, so I'm not like speeding up a whole lot. All right, straighten out just a little bit more. Pull. a little bit more thrust. Slow down some more. Okay, it's looking good. It's looking good. Slow down just a tad more here. I'm gonna make this as gentle of a landing as possible. Okay. Gently, 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 and kill the engines. Oh, 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 come on. Yeah! Yeah, that's right, we landed. We landed. That's how we do. That's how we do. Let's turn off, uh, well, let's leave that on, but yeah, we did it. Okay, so electric charge is getting a little, a little low, so let's turn that off. Okay. Yeah, that's right, that's how we do it. Awesome, awesome. Um, we landed on Mun. I keep calling it the moon, but it's Mun. There's the planet. I made, I changed where we landed just a little bit so we could actually see the planet this time. Um, just trying to see if I can. Let's see. Let's do this. Maybe, maybe if we like, like do that. Kill that and screech out. Okay. Beautiful. Look at that. Now what we get to do. Let's figure out uh, where my ladders are at. Here it is. Okay. Extend that ladder. Extend this ladder. Why are my ladders inside of these things? <clears throat> did I did I not like paying attention when I did this, I guess? What the heck? I don't know if he's gonna be able to get back in it. Oh wait, no no, he can get back in. Oh hold on. We're on the moon. <laughs> 
Um, it's the gravity soul light. Okay, so what do we want? We let's go with uh, let's go with this guy. EVI time. Whoa, 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 whoa! What's that for? What'd you do that for? Jeez. It's like yeah, I'm just gonna jump down onto the ground like that because I'm cool, cool, cool. All right. Let's uh, turn off the jet back. Yeah, look at that. We're on, we're on the mun. All right. So, is there anything for us to see here? I think I heard that this was be like e you can find like Easter eggs and stuff like that on here. Um, I don't see anything near us though. So probably not much of anything for us to do. But hey, we made it. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Let's uh run over this way a little bit. Yeah, just look how happy he is. Look at him. Alright. So now if we go... Actually, let's go over like this. Yeah, let's do the point that way and jump. And jump again. Good shot. Okay. Beautiful. Alright, guy. Turn that jetpack on. Now go up. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, 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 nope. Jeez. All right. Now let's jetpack him over onto the top of the spacecraft here, so we can get back in it. Grab that. Okay. Beautiful. Look at that. And board it. Okay, so we're back inside. Let's uh, bring this thing back in. And let's see if we can make it back to uh, Kerbal. So, okay, there we go. Alright, so, the way back is right there, so let's get ourselves back into orbit. So, let's lift off. Should be pretty easy, considering this is the moon. So let's just uh, go straight up like so. And let's kill that. Probably more than enough thrust as it is already. Um, actually, hold on. Let's go a little bit faster. Let's get that out just a bit further. Okay, that looks good. Alright, <clears throat> so uh, let me see if we can line ourselves up here like so. And then let's go and speed up. Let's get ourselves out here a little bit more. And there we are. Okay. Now let's go and line up with this one. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Alright. Oh, I think I'm going to sneeze. Let me mute my mic here. Alright. At least I was able to actually get to the mic this time before I sneezed. Okay. Okay, that looks good. Now let's go full throttle here. Nice thing about being such a little gravity on Mun here is that it's nice and easy to make adjustments like an orbit. So let's go and get ourselves into this orbit here. And kill that. Okay, so 24. Uh, that should be good right there. Okay. So we're in an orbit. Now, how's our fuel holding up? Uh, barely any. Alright. So I have to basically do this just right now so we ha I can actually get myself into uh, trajectory to go back to Kerbal. Uh, because we want to make sure that <clears throat> we don't get stuck here forever. Okay, so what we could do is if we go here and we speed up, we might shoot ourselves out that way. Um, we're not in the best orbit for this, but I don't have enough fuel to really make any changes. So we could go here and try to speed up and extend that. I'm thinking we want to extend this one. Um, so let's uh, speed th this warp a little bit. Um, wait a little bit here. Come on. <clears throat> okay. Let's get ourselves up a little bit closer to this. And there we are. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so let's go. Get ourselves adjusted here. Oop, 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 oop. Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay. Oh, I don't even have this stuff on. Alright, let's fix that. Alright, so where am I? Let's see, there's the sun. So right now I'm pointed back down the way 
we came from, which is not what I want, as you can tell by that symbol there. So if we go and flip ourselves over this way, and ooh, that was actually really good. Look at that. Okay, so let's line up with that. So there we are. So now what we can do <coughs> is let's burn. Let's do ourselves a burn here. If we get out far enough, we should get to the point where Kerbal's going to grab us. Okay. So, here's an escape from Mun. Um, so what we're going to do... Oops, 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 don't do that. I don't have enough fuel to be doing that. Okay. Let's speed up. And let's get out of the orbit of Mun. Alright. Good, good. And... Speed up a little more. There we go. We left Mun. Okay, so now we're back in orbit around Kerbin. So, <clears throat> what we want to do uh, to get ourselves on it is slow ourselves down now. So, what we're going to do here is let's go and let's speed ourselves up and get over to this one. And there we are. Okay. <coughs> yeah, excuse me, man. I don't know why I'm coughing so much. Okay. So. Let me uh, see, where are we? Okay. But yeah, we're going to want to go and face ourselves this way. So we can slow ourselves down this time, not speed up. Like so. Rotate. Alright. And that should be good. Okay, so here we go. So now we're like that. Now we're going to go and we're going to throttle up all the way. And as you can see, actually just only throttle a little bit. Um, we're closing that, and we're gonna get to the point where we're actually gonna end up coming in really close to curve in here. Uh, how far away is it from the planet, though? Little ways. So let's bring it in some more. Bring it into about a hundred is what I want. Right there. Okay, that's good enough. We could bring ourselves in to dip in through the atmosphere, but then... Nah, we won't do that. Okay. So we can speed up. Let's come in here. Alright. <clears throat> okay, so there's that. So what we want to do now is go back to the ship. Oh man, we like have no fuel. Okay. But hey, we're back in orbit, of, or well, we're in an orbit of the planet, so that's good. Ooh, wait, wait, where are we? Oh, cool, look at that, okay. So let's go and let's spin ourselves around, because now we got to slow ourselves down. <coughs> um, whoa, 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 okay. And line up with this. Alright, and throttle up. Oh, there goes some of my one of my sets of engines. Slow this thing down. All right. Come on, I have enough fuel for this, right? Uh oh. Great. That's a sell one. Okay. <clears throat> so we're out of fuel. Our CS time. These things might slow me down just enough to do what we need to do. I have had to use RCS thrusters before for stuff like this. Okay. Alright, so since I chose not to, we don't actually dip into the atmosphere just for that to slow us down. So we will not ever actually necessarily enter. Um, <coughs> dang it, hold on one sec, guys. <coughs> All right, um, there. That's better. I don't know. I think I had a pops popsicle before I recorded. I'm thinking that might be the issue. <laughs> All right, let's go and speed up. Oh. Don't do that. I have an idea of what I want to try. So what we're gonna get do is get ourselves up here. Let's get ourselves around the planet. Nice and easy. And. Get up to that. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. So, now let's go and let's point ourselves the opposite direction. Nope. Don't go too far. 
Okay. This should be the right way. So now what we're going to do is we're facing the other way, so we're going to slow ourselves down again. So let's kick these back in. And now what I'm hoping, <clears throat> and what it should be doing, as you can see, it's bringing us down on this end. So I want to do this just enough to bring us down to where we actually are going to dip into the atmosphere, which we are. Starting to here. So let's bring that thing in. That way we can uh, actually re-enter the planet. So let's just keep slowing down here a little bit. Bring ourselves in nice and close. And... Be cool if we could somehow get onto into this area. How much? How are we doing on the fuel for this thing? Wrong thing. Nope. Wrong thing again. Oh, practically out, almost. All right. <clears throat> so I swing us down to twenty. We'll call that good. Okay. So there we are. So now let's go and speed ourselves up. Zoom in. And what should happen now is, yep, see, we can only do four times because we're inside of the atmosphere. So let's go and spin ourselves around here. Let's actually turn that around. Like so. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Let's straighten ourselves out just a little bit here. Like that. And then uh, let's slow down. All right, we're pretty low. So uh, we are going really fast, though. So I'm hoping that we're not going so fast that we're just going to shoot right through to the other side of the atmosphere and go back into orbit. Um, we should hopefully, either way, the atmosphere should slow us down enough so that even if that does happen, the next pass we should get caught and come back in. Um, this is not the best reentry ever, but yeah. Okay, well, that's empty. So let me see. Let's spin this thing around here. And goodbye. Don't need you anymore. All right. Yeah. There's no way we're going back out. We're hitting that. We're starting to do the reentry burn. Okay. So that's gone. We'll just uh, line ourselves up here so we or we have the right side facing. Goodbye. Thanks for everything you did for us. All right. It's just gonna keep on reentry burning. Look at that. What, what is there? Oops, wrong thing again. <clears throat> Alright, look at this. That's pretty cool. That's yeah, got a cool view. <laughs> Alright. So let's just keep re entering the atmosphere. What's our trajectory looking like? Oh, yeah, definitely coming down on the planet. No problem. This is it re entry? Re entering the atmosphere is slowing us down so much. Okay, so let's point ourselves a little bit more again. Just gonna keep on coming in. Um, let's see about maybe speeding this up just a tad bit. Okay. Tad bit more. A little bit more. Speed it up all the way. Okay. And go down to normal speed and let's blow the chutes. Alright. So we got the chutes out. So let's speed ourselves up here again. And it should be about um, 500 above is when they should uh, deploy. Alright, so they should deploy at about 500. Boom, there they go. A little bit of g-force, slowed ourselves down. And now let's just go down and they're gonna land. Almost down to the ground. Yeah, these guys got to go to the moon, leave the moon, and come back. It's beautiful. Second time I've done that now. There it is. Awesome. So, we're back on the planet. How much power do we have? Oh, plenty of power. Plenty, plenty of power. Yep. Worked out pretty well. So, there they are. They're back on uh, the planet here. Um, like I said, though, if we go here, actually, this ship is just the same ship that we just used, but uh, it's still in orbit around the planet. Didn't actually send it anywhere yet. I've just been leaving it up here. Um, because, you know, who knows, maybe I want to do something with it. Uh, as you can see, if you look at the time up here, they've been, uh, they've been up here a long time. Poor guys. <laughs> look at that guy. He seems to be just enjoying himself, though. 
Oh, I I could bring them home, but nah, they'll be fine. Let's go to the space probe so you can see what my satellite looks like. Here's the satellite. <clears throat> Animation spinning the solar rays around to point at the sun. Electrical charge doing good. Why aren't these ones rotating? Those ones supposed to rotate too? Maybe they. Just, well, maybe it's because you know if you look at it, there's the angle so steep. It's just not like worth it for them to rotate, really. But yeah, so here's my solar panels. Um, I know I put more on there than I needed, but it looks awesome. And then here's the the dish. Um, it only points at the planet at the at a certain time. Um, like I said, I could have done a much better job of this. But if we get ourselves locked on here, um, like so, you can see that here, like the dark side is getting it um, from the satellite now. Uh, I think that's where we launch, or where the space center is, is somewhere in that area. But yeah, see, so we can just rotate ourselves around here like so, and it's just gonna it just keeps rotating around the planet like this forever. Um, works out pretty well. And then if we speed ourselves up enough to the point where we actually get around the sun a bit here, the solar rays should keep turning. Because we have to get, our, if we get around the sun to the right point around the sun, then uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny. It keeps slowing me down a bit because we get too close to the planet. But if we get to the around the sun just right, then it should start using all the solar panels again. As you can see, these ones here just slowly keep up with the sun here. Um, but these ones here do, you know, obviously get used. And they should start to do stuff once we get ourselves pointed more towards the sun here. So that's why we're getting ourselves over this way. All right, but yeah, so that now these ones are being used too. So let's uh, drop it back down to normal speed, and here we are. So so that they got sunlight again. So it's working out pretty well. Oh, and an eye for fun, you know, I put lights all over this thing. This thing, this thing's got some light power. Right. <laughs> the lights on in this game are kind of cool because of how they like they do like the realistic like cooling down and turning on type thing. Uh, I got an ion thruster here. I swear it's completely useless. Like, it doesn't do anything. I don't think I've ever actually noticed it Noticed it to actually do a single thing yet. Um, but yeah, then here's my satellite communication dish um, or communications and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, so that's it. Um, let's go back uh, here. Um, let's go back to the space center. Alright, there we are, and let's go here. Alright, so the guys that we just brought down on the planet are right here. And let's recover it. Alright, what is going on here? Ready to launch? I have a space plane on, on there ready to launch? Let's see. Load. All right. Yeah. Well, would you look at that? I do. Okay. Let's put the brakes on for this for right now. Um. Huh. Let me grab uh, my controller here so I can control this thing a little bit better. All right. So yeah, here's the space plane. Let's uh go and get ourselves inside the cockpit view. Oh no! Probably help hit the right buttons. There we go. All right, here we are. Let's go and get these engines running. Throttle ourselves up all the way, and that should have hopefully killed the brakes, right? Okay. All right. Now let's take off. This one needs a lot more runway than some of the other ones I have. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Let's turn on uh, the SAS system. Okay. Alright. Here, let's take a look and see if everything's holding up on this system just right, because. Yeah, the brakes were off. Okay, good. Alright, so yeah, there we go. We got ourselves a space plane going that I did not know I actually had. Um, 
sitting on the thing. Okay, so what we can do, you know, is we could uh, take this thing for a little bit of a flight. There's no real places to fly to at the moment. Um, what I'm thinking we should do here, though, is let's go and pull her back around. And let's see if we can take it in for a landing for fun. I think I'm getting better at doing this, which is good. Um, and where is it? There it is. Okay. Let's uh, slow ourselves down a bit. Alright. Let's move back down here so we're not so high up in the air. Um, let's go over this way a little bit or else we're going to completely go right by this runway. Alright. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, let's uh... This is probably not how, like, if you were a real pilot in real life, how you would be doing this, but... Alright. Whoa! Whoa, come on, hit the runway. Oh, wheel, wheels... Nose up, nose up. Oh, okay, good, good. Okay, we hit the ground. Um, so I have the brakes on. So, there we go. We landed. Look at that. Okay, what did, what broke? We lost one of our engines. <laughs> okay. I must have had the nose too far up then, I guess. Uh, so we lost an engine, which means that probably taking back off like this is probably not a good idea. Um, you know what? I'm thinking that we're going to crash into a building, aren't we? Okay. Okay, let me get those all the way up to full thrust. And, oh no, 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 no. Okay, go buy it. Yep, good, good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, not good. Nope, nope, that's nope. Nope. Don't think that's what's supposed to happen. Okay. Let's, uh. Let's go back to the Space Center. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, that was fun. Because I would like to try to get into an interplanetary mission one that's actually going. Um, if we go to the tracking station here, um, as you can see it shows that there's three things, which you only see two here, correct? Well, one of them, this thing, uh, let's zoom out here, is a little ways away. It's been outside of the solar system for a while now. Uh, it's been going for uh, over four years. Uh, basically what I'm tr doing is it's, it's not moving very fast. It's like here, let's uh, let's go to it. All right, sorry about that, guys. Uh, it came crashed for some reason. It like showed me the ship like all destroyed for a second, and then the game crashed out. So yeah, but here it is. This ship here is on a um, very long mission. Uh, it's still got electrical charge, which is good. Um, I actually don't know how long that's going to go for. Um, I don't know why those are on. Let's turn those off. Save it, conserve energy, and all that fun stuff. But yeah, basically, as you can see, uh, there's the sun. It's uh, really far away. We are currently on, as you can see here, by what I was showing you, uh, a very far away trajectory. Um, the reason why you're seeing this purple line shake every now and then uh, is because I'm on the proper trajectory for what I want. But after a very long time, as, as you can see, it's been go doing this for a very long time already. Um, this is going to go all the way out here, swing back around, come back in like so. And then, here, let's go into the... Let me see, where is... Let's lock on to this so I get a better view. Um, this is what I'm going for. As you can see, it shows right here, it's going to be an intersect, intersect. After it comes in here and loops around, it's going to come back around here and intersect with uh, Joel. So if we go and zoom in here, this is where I'm headed right now. Um, my goal, what I would like to do, is I'd like to get to this planet here and land on it. Um, when I saw it, there was a uh, another planet that looks like a habitable one. Habitable one. That seemed cool. I was like, oh, I gotta gotta try and get to this. So this is what I'm going for. Uh, it's gonna take a very long time, for sure. Like here, let me. Let's zoom back out again. Let's lock onto the ship. 
And now watch, I'm going to go and speed this up to the max simulation speed. It's not, it doesn't even look like it's moving at all. The speed is only 2200 and it's slowing down. So it's, you know, it's obviously going to go all the way up here and it's going to be going really slow by this point, by the time it gets up here and then it's going to fall back down to the sun. So basically, yeah, we're going, we're, it's like, if you think about it for a second, it's like we're going something flying so fast that it's going up in the air in the sky. And then when it gets to here, it's going to finally hit the point where it's not moving fast enough to counteract the gravity and it's going to fall back down to the ground. But that's basically kind of what we're doing right now. We're basically flying up away from the sun and eventually we're going to fall back into the sun. Um, that's what we need to do is come back around, fall towards the sun, and then end up here. Uh, it's taken a very long time. So I don't know if I'm ever actually going to make it, but, you know, I'm just been letting it go. I mean, why not? Just let it go in the background. Uh, I was hoping to get this ship here originally to line up with this planet here uh, before, you know, going outside of the solar system, but that didn't happen. And then when it showed that it was going to have an intersect eventually, I decided, ah, why not? I'll just let the thing go forever. So that's what I'm doing. It's basically letting it go forever. Um, let's go and slow ourselves all the way back down here. And let's go back to the space center. All right. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, there it is. I think that's uh, going to wrap it up for this episode. I hope you guys uh, liked it. I hope you guys are liking uh, liking the series here. And thanks for watching. Hope you if you did like it, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. And yeah, we, we, I think we did some good stuff. I mean, we made, we landed on the moon this time without blowing up or crashing. What's the first time that this count? And then, uh, left the moon and barely, we barely made it back to the planet because we ran out of fuel. We did make it back to the planet safely. So it was a successful mission. So, once again, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys all later. Bye bye.